Welcome back to Poker Celeb. How are you doing? I hope you're having a great day. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Jada Smith calling out Chris Rock for dragging out the drama. But before we begin with today's topic, make sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the notifications so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. It seems as though Jada Pinkett Smith feels that Chris Rock is prolonging the drama by announcing that he will not be attending the Academy Awards next year. Following Will Smith's infamous slap at the 2022 Oscars earlier this year, Chris Rock reportedly turned down an offer to host the Oscars the following year. The comedian revealed during a stand-up show in Phoenix, Arizona that the awards organizers had asked him to return as host for a third time. Will Smith, who was about to receive his Best Actor award, slapped Rock on stage earlier this year while Rock was presenting the documentary award. Rock made a joke about Smith's wife, Jada Pinkett Smith. Rock reportedly compared accepting the hosting gig to returning to the scene of a crime during the show. Referring to the O.J. Simpson's murder trial, which revealed that Simpson's ex-murderer's wife's night began with her leaving a pair of eyeglasses at an Italian restaurant. Returning to the Oscars, according to Rock, is akin to asking Nicole Brown Simpson to go back to the restaurant, according to the Arizona Republic. An audience member yelled, Talk about it. Smith's portrayal of boxer Muhammad Ali in the 2001 biopic Ali earned Smith his first Academy Award nomination. He's bigger than me, Rock continued, adding the state of Nevada would not sanction a fight between me and Will Smith. The Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences did not respond to Rock's comments. Earlier this summer, Smith finally posted an apology to the comedian, whom he slapped after Rock made a joke about the hairstyle of Jada Pinkett Smith, Will Smith's wife. Smith uploaded a five-minute video to his YouTube channel entitled, It's Been a Minute. In the video, he answered questions from fans about the incident, the first of which asked why Smith didn't apologize to Rock in his acceptance speech. Smith said in the video, I was fogged out by that point, adding, it is all fuzzy. I reached out to Chris and the message that came back is that he's not ready to talk. When he is, he'll reach out. Smith went on to publicly apologize to Rock and other members of his family. He said, I will say to you, Chris, I apologize to you. He then said, my behavior was unacceptable and I am here whenever you are ready to talk. He also apologized to Chris's mother saying, I want to apologize to Chris's mother. I saw an interview she did and that was one of the things that I just didn't realize. I wasn't thinking, but how many people got hurt at that moment? I want to apologize to Chris's mother. I want to apologize to Chris's family, specifically Tony Rock. We had a great relationship. Tony Rock was my man. This is probably irreparable. Another question Smith answered had to do with Jada. He was asked whether she prompted him to walk onto the stage and slap Rock, especially considering he laughed as soon as Rock said the joke until he looked at his wife's face, of course. No, I made a choice on my own, he said. From my own experience and my history with Chris, clarifying. Jada had nothing to do with it. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, babe, and I want to say sorry to my kids and my family for the heat that I brought on all of us. He continued to apologize to the nominees and winners that night, many of whom were overshadowed and forgotten by Smith's actions. Questlove, the winner of the award Rock was presenting, was one major example of this. He said, I won because you voted for me and it really breaks my heart to have stolen and tarnished your moment. Adding, I can still see Questlove's eyes, it happened on Questlove's award, and I'm sorry isn't really sufficient. Rock himself addressed the incident during his show at the PNC Bank Arts Center in Homdel, New Jersey on the 24th of July. He said, anyone who says words hurt has never been punched in the face. He then added, I'm not a victim, mother, yeah, that's hurt, mother, but I took that sort of went off to work the next day. I won't go to the hospital for a paper cut. Smith previously apologized to Rock shortly after the incident on his Instagram. He wrote this. I would like to publicly apologize to Chris. I was out of line and I was wrong. I'm embarrassed at my actions. They were not indicative of the man I want to be. There is no place for violence in the world of love and kindness. Smith subsequently resigned from the Academy and was barred from attending any Oscar related events for the next 10 years. And earlier this month, Bill Kramer, the incoming Academy CEO, said that the Academy is committed to having a host on the show next year, after a three-year run without central personalities, and was already looking at some key partners on that. Kramer also noted the slap would be off-limits for jokes at next year's ceremony. He said, We want to move forward and to have an Oscars that celebrates cinema. That's our focus right now. 
That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.